Installing the Anchor Make Extruder Printhead. I'm Jonah Rose. I'll be going over the installation of the Anchor Make Extruder. Take out the new extruder. Get the H2.0 driver from your Anchor Make toolkit. Loosen and remove the four outer screws from the back of the extruder. Take off the top cover. Remove the nozzle casing as well. There is one remaining screw holding the bottom cover in place. Remove it. Remove the bottom extruder cover. Next, we will need to loosen the V-wheel. I used the included H3.0 driver and the M8 wrench. I did use the flat screwdriver as well. The screwdriver helped when the wrench couldn't reach. Put the extruder back to the printer, secure the bottom V-wheel. I used the screwdriver again to provide stability for the final tightness. Align the X-axis belt retainer to the extruder. Unplug the motor cable and secure the bottom retainer screw. Replug the motor cable, then install the top screw. Slide the extruder manually, noticing the smoothness and sounds. If issues are found, try adjusting the wheel nut with the M10 wrench. Replace the bottom cover and the single front screw. Screw in the bottom two screws on the back side. Reapply the anchor make nozzle casing. Screw the top two screws on the back of the nozzle casing. If necessary, remove the attached metal tube connector. Route the connected tube connector through the face down extruder top cover. Secure the tube connector to the extruder using the M8 wrench. Put the extruder's top into place. Plug the extruder's USB-C cable. Tighten the screws on the back of the USB-C cable to the extruder's bracket, using the H2.0 driver for these two screws. The machine is good to go. Check for updates, run the auto level, do a test print. Enjoy. Find time for kindness and use plastic responsibly.